Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to part 30 of the Aravaki campaign. This is Hannibal at the Gates, Total War Rome 2 and I do have a quick apology to say before I get into things here. This week I did upload part 27 accidentally before I uploaded part 25 and 26. Now what I did was I scheduled all my videos and unfortunately I selected the wrong day. I selected May the 2nd when I wanted May the... May the 6th I think it was, so it meant that you got to see part 27 a couple of days before part 25 and 26, so I do apologise, but by the time this video is up everything should be corrected and in order, certainly in the playlist anyway. But back into this campaign, so, we're at war with the Gallic Confederation, I won a battle here last time with this army, the Horns of NATO, and we are currently on track to march towards Tolosa. Now I'm going to try and take Tolosa in this episode, and then stage and advance towards Nemausus. We have five units of ballista here, that's pretty good. What's this? Navy, don't think we need to worry about that too much. Public order is quite good, I think. So a quick look just before I get into things. So, let's uh, see. Hispania, Cytulia is on 19. Boom, 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 wrong way. Mauritania is plus six. Lusitania is plus two. What the hell's going on there? There we go, it's fine. Back up here, Aquitania plus two, and Numantia is plus seven. Yeah, it looks like everything's good. So everything's in the in the plus at the moment. My finances have gone up as well because I've got rid of a lot of mercenaries that I had. I think I can most probably end turn. Just gonna go on the uh, oh, what's it called diplomacy screen. God, my head is all over the place today. Diplomacy screen, right? We let's see. Do, do, do. We really know four factions at the moment, and they none of them are too friendly. The Gallics don't like me. Rome doesn't like me, but I'm heading towards Rome anyway. If I carry on through here, through the Alps, so we may end up taking on Rome before I take on Carthage. I want to take on Carthage eventually. The good thing for me is I'm actually trading with them and the Massili tribe here in Numidia. Neutral. Why don't they like me? Treaties with Massili. Are they at war with them? No, they are the military allies, but they don't like me. They don't like my treaties with Massili. That's strange. What about Massili? They don't like my treaties with Carthage, but they're allies. That don't make sense. Ah, uh, Poddlecock. <laughs> Let's end turn. Let's see what we can do now after this end turn. And I hope we're having a great day. It is evening time here in the UK as I record this episode. Gallic Confederation. Oh, not a spy. Anything but a spy. I hate it when they do that. It stops my advance towards uh, Tolosa, I think. Oh, duty calls. Oh, they've killed my spy, have they? Ah, oh, oh, wounded. No, they wounded him, right. And I want some noble cavalry and Medos. Do you want him? I like the cheap ones, to be honest with you. Yeah, we'll go for Medos or Medos. Go with Medos. Thirsty for a battle. And we can actually advance towards... Oh, we haven't got many movement points, though. We can't quite get to Tolosa, but we can get this far. What do they have? They don't have much here. Excellent. Gallia Transalpina. This is the first part of this province that we're going to take. And now this army, which is here, can, can go to the edge of the border here. We can probably advance. I probably could have taken the town with that army and gone north with this one. I probably should have done that, but yeah, I think I'm doing it the, the sensible way. I can take two armies north if, once I take Tolosa. They have a garrison of ten. Uh, slingers, tribesmen, light horse. We should be okay. Excellent. Right. I ain't got some money to spend. I need to work on spending that money. What's this army doing? We're in force march for some reason. Don't want that bullshit. Right. Now, I'm going to quickly go through my provinces again because I want to check that I'm doing... Oh, God. Right. Minus 86 public order. I've only got plus two. I want to take this army out eventually, so... Let's try and work on this. So, let's repair that for now. It's a reservoir. It gives me food and growth, so it's important to repair that. The culture is also against me here. Let's see. Mostly Celtic culture. We need something which can... Shrine of NATO. What can I have instead? Do, 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 do. Uh, something to give me Iberian culture. Probably gone past it. Ah! Shrine of Endovlicius or Endovelicus, Endovelicus. 
that'll do. Shrine of Endo. It costs 1,164, which gives me three Iberian culture. It might be worth converting this at a later date. I think for now we're okay. I'm going to have a quick look at my objectives as well, because as you can see I have four of the provinces I need. The other two Carthage has part of with me, and that's for a that's a primary objective, that is. Ultimate objective is what we want to look at, though. As you can see, we need Africa, Latium et Campania, and Hispania Ulterior. I thought we had that. Oh, wait, is that, that's the one the Carthage has, right? This is Interior, I think we have. Is it Interior? I want to check this. I'm a bit confused. Citeria, okay. So many Interiors, Citerias, and Ulteriors. Hard to keep up. I hate these spies. I want to get rid of these spies. Could do with some spies of my own. Ah, right, we can convert. Oh, we can't, we've got any money. Shit. Alright, we need more money, we can't do anything else this turn. So I think we're probably just going to end turn again. Fly through these end turns, try and get some of this campaign done in this episode. Holy shit, we have a, a large army which has attacked us, or has come towards us. Shit. Right, it's uh, sabotage, subversion, okay, regard. Don't worry about that bullshit. What we got? Full stack army, holy mackerel, right? That's not gonna be good. We must take on this large army. If I attack Tolosa with this army, what happens? Let's see. I don't think they're in range, so. No, they're not in range, but my reinforcements are excellent. So we're gonna fight this battle, and I shall see you all on the battle map. Hello, and welcome back. So my ballistas all over here have my scorpions in position to attack which they will be doing shortly into their flank I have my ballista in the rear over here before long they'll be in my position again my reinforcements are actually going to be coming from behind as you can see over here which is excellent for me I can straight away outflank the enemy this is great this is holy shit this is good this is good they're gonna to come towards me we're just gonna outflank them with the cav we're gonna push forward with the slingers I want to keep as much as my of my uh, ballistas as possible. We've got that large army to try and take out onto the campaign map. Mounted warriors, run, curse you, you ragscallion! Let's bring everything forward about there. Okay, this is good. Light horse getting charged by three units of cavalry. They're going to get completely decimated in this charge. Boom! Get in there. Frenzy charge, he's a goner. A bit late with that other fren frenzied uh, charge. Holy shit. Right, let's see. Oh, I haven't grouped everything properly. It's not good. Wanted to group all the slingers. I haven't quite. Oh my god, what have I done? Warriors. They've only got. If mainly got slingers, we're gonna. We're gonna completely kill the. The enemy here, I think. Oh my god. Man, 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 man. Noble cavalry, you can deal with them. You can just charge your ass down there and take out some of the slingers. Gonna take two units to attack this unit one here. And the general's gonna flank. Slingers are gonna charge there. Cavalry's gonna go in there, and we're gonna completely round up the enemy now. This is gonna be a fairly straightforward uh, a battle, I think. We're gonna not even bother with these units, our reinforcements, so you can just halt. Radios, here you go for battle. Flank with them. Charge, get a little bit of unit cam going guys, holy shit look at this crap, get in there come on, charge, die you bastards, ah, excellent, very nice stuff indeed, they're, they're gone, they're gone, there we go, we have victory, we're going to continue quickly, and I'm going to get my slingers to stop firing, because that's not good for me, let's get the cav to carry on killing, and we're going to fast forward this slightly as well, because we don't want to watch me round up because it'll be kind of boring to to watch as a viewer just, just get a few more kills, let's have a look at the cavalry kill in a minute 96 kills with them, 103, 98, that's good, that's good okay we'll end battle now, just wanted to get a few more kills get the experience going a bit more lost 318, I can live with that they lost most of their men, we have taken Tolosa so that's the first big thing of this war with the Gallic Confederation, we've taken Tolosa didn't suffer too many losses and I can now venture forth and attack that large uh, army which is nearby. We're going to occupy Tolosa. Increase in rank for me. We're going to do that.
do the increase quickly here. Oh my god, what we can do for? We can go for whoops, zeal and morale, which is good. We can go for authority and morale for all units, just plus two morale, minus ten for all enemy. Oh, that might be good actually. Melee defense could be good. Uh, authority, morale for all units, army only, unit cost, that's good. I like the one which. Cavalry, that could be good. I'm going to go for this one because I like to um, deter the enemy as much as possible. Now my army can only go so far. We're going to keep it in Tolosa for now. I could attack them now, but uh, I don't know. 19. I don't know if they don't think they wouldn't be in range, would they? Because these geezers weren't in range either. The town is there. We need to step back to here. We do step back to about there. Now they should be in range if they attack me. I'm going to fortify my position. Yeah, this is good, because I think they can't come around, there's no actual cross in here. So they can only go through this way. Yeah, this sounds like a sound strategy, I think. I hope I'm right now, because if I'm wrong, I'm, I might not have my reinforcements, which I need. Although, saying that, we could just attack them the following turn. Anyway, back to the campaign map, and Emporia, I wanted to go for... Where's the Iberian culture gone? Mm, it's gone. Oh, isn't it this one? Yeah, this one. Grove of Endovilicus, whatever the f you pronounce it. We want that, and we also want to convert... Oh, we want to repair the port, I think. I think we want to repair the port. It repairs by itself automatically if you don't turn by turn until it's eventually repaired. Eluda. Or Iruna, sorry. Iruna. We have farm. Plenty of farms. It's good to have farms. Could have a law master instead. I don't think we need her at the moment. Public order's fairly good there. Just gonna quickly branch around the place, just look for what I have. Some do but yeah, I think this is what we need to repay actually. Oh, actually yeah, I know where I need to go. All the way down here to Rutabus, because I, I remember now we have all these buildings which we want to to sort out, so first oh we can't do it. Shit. Oh, what are we done? Look at that. Oh my god, what am I doing? Right, let's just double check. Rutabus, we lose in population here every turn, which is not good for me. We want to sort this out as quickly as possible. Eastern, Eastern Village, convert this mantle. Don't have enough money to get that. Light horse studs could be useful in the in the desert. Noble quarters can't have that because not a faction type. We're just gonna have to dismantle it, I think, for now. Uh, we can. I'll tell you what. We will leave the money for now, and we we'll just go back to it the following turn. I don't think there's anything else I can do, maybe this? No, See, I, want, I want to actually have the money to change it rather than... I could... Uh, I'll repair the port for now here, we'll just do that. That should be okay, and I think we're okay for this by here, so we can probably end turn again. And we'll see then what the enemy decides to do in this end turn phase. And while that's going on, I'll check my phone quickly. Have a text message coming through. A popular boy, I think. Oh, look! Just look back up, and and <laughs> the enemy's charging me. I got my reinforcements. That's the main thing. No, I haven't. Fuck! Why didn't they? Oh man, that's not good. That is not good at all. I thought my reinforcements would be there to. Ah, oh, my God! Right, we'll see you all on the battle map. Hello and welcome back to the battlefield and we are going to take our cavalry to the right flank. Now I was hoping that my secondary army was reinforcing but I was wrong about it I'm afraid and it looks like that's not the case and for some reason my cavalry isn't moving. What is going on here? What is this sorcery? Come on, there we go. They're moving finally. So the cavalry is on the way. We have... we don't have much of a chance I don't think. They, they outnumber us, they have nearly a full stack army. We do have some ballista, we need to hope to god that we can do a hell of a lot of damage to the the enemy. Where's the general? Where's the general? Oh, he's over there. Can we get him with the ballista or anything? Can we get him with anything? Do, 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 do. No, we are quite out of range. We're going to get our ballista ourselves to to attack them there. So, we're going to get our cavalry to all flank around. We're going to try and take out as many as we can with the cavalry units. 
hold up for as long as possible just to allow my ballista crews to continue to fire upon the enemy. Oh, this is good. We're flanking around with the cavalry. I need to use the cavalry as best I can in this battle. We're going to go straight for the... Oh, shit, they're spear nobles. This, is, this isn't a wise strategy, I'm afraid, but... You know what? It's got to be done. It has to be done because I don't have much of a, a choice. As things stand... Hold... Hold the general up there. With them. Oh, I, got, I see an opportunity here. I see an opportunity to flank with this unit of cavalry while the other two hold the spear nobles up. Right, this is good. This is what I wanted. We are doing some kills. We are being, going to be the worst off though, I'm afraid. But let's get in there and take out some of these slingers. Meanwhile, back at the wall. Scutari, spearmen, get in there quickly. Get your asses in there. We have Scutari. We need to use these Scutari. Come on, you Scutari warriors. Get your asses in there, and you get in there as well. Where's my cavalry gone? Holy shit! Come on, you m m m m m weird person! Come on, get your cavalry asses out there. Go for the garlic hunters. Go for the missionary garlic hunters. Ah, oh, this isn't good. I'm gonna disengage with this unit of cavalry as well. My ballista is firing upon the enemy. Upon the general. That's what I want. Try and try and take out the general if possible. Oh, this, this is a disaster, this battle so far. Come on, get your asses over there. Come on. Horsemen! Let's get the scorpions to try and deal some damage upon our friends over here. Come on, get in there. I'm going to chase down the fleeing warriors over there. How are we doing at the ball? Can't tell, to be honest with you. Cannot tell at all. Slingers, attack. Quick reload. Deadly missiles are ready. General is getting a big beat in at the moment, which is good. We like it when the general gets a beat in. Why is my cavalry losing out here? This is not fair. Holy shit. We're getting skirmishers and we're losing. Just get them to attack this unit down there. Not much, not much of a wall here, I'm afraid. I think the scorpions are going to have to attack the spear warriors. General is down to 83 men, which is good for me. Ballista! Get your asses over there, Ballista! Oh man, this is going to be a difficult, difficult battle. Right, let's get the, let's get the rally going. And the frenzy, get the frenzy. Anyone have frenzy? We have frenzy over here. Hopefully this will come at the right time. How's the cavalry doing? Oh my god, we're doing... Oh, we're going to get outflanked. That's not good. Disengage, disengage, disengage. We're dealing enough damage there. Holy shit, look at these guys. Let's, let's push our way out. I didn't even realise then that the slingers were attacking my skirmishers. We're going to pull out. I know it's going to leave a gap in the wall, but I don't have much of a choice at the moment. It's war cry, some of these units as well. Spear warriors there, perhaps. I won't go for the rally and inspire yet. What is my ballista crew doing? Holy shit, get out there, you fools. You fools, get out there. I didn't realise they pushed all the way forward then. Come on, attack the general. Oh, this isn't good. This is a big, a bit of a disaster. I don't have any cavalry left. Shit, 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 shit. The battle ready. Battle ready. Oh my god. Watch me do a suicidal move, guys. Holy shit, the tree's in the way. It's not good. Oh, I was hoping to try and take some of them out there. Can we get them over here, maybe? I think we can. No, we can't. What are you doing? That's a bit more like it. Yeah! So we just just kneecapped a few horses there. Excellent. And again? I think we should go again. What? Oh, out of ammunition. Okay. You've done your duty. No, bugger off down there. No, go to the couch barn, actually. You can be your last kind of... Hurrah for me. We've done quite well. We're attacking the light horse. Shield artillery. Oh my god, the general's through, the general's through. Get my get my firing shots on. Come on. Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> That's me panicking. Everyone, just attack the general for fuck's sake. Oh, he's down to 58. We can do this. Slingers, attack, you, you weird slings. Oh, 
Oh, I can't believe I missed that. Come on, get the shot off. Get back to me. Get back to me, man. Get back to me. Right, General, time to do your rally and rally and inspire to the Scutari Spearman. They're going to be what wins me this, if I can win this. Oh, this is terrible. This is... This is... My God. Right, we have to attack the mercenary Gallic horse, I'm afraid. Oh, my God. This is... This is it's a disaster. Oh my god, we lost all the ballista crews. The general's going to take this himself by the looks of things. Everyone just go with them. Do I have any units down here? No, I don't. These slingers could have done better for me, I'm afraid, but they didn't. Come on, get in there and kill some of these spear nobles. They're taking the capture point. Give ourselves a little bit of inspiration. Give the Iberian Spearman some inspiration. Get some war cry going and get some second wind for my general. It's all I can do there, I'm afraid. Oh, and we are routing the general, which is good. Excellent. We are routing the general. Just get it, everything on the general. Holy crap. Come on. Turn off skirmish mode. Just attack. That's right. I should turn skirmish mode off at the start of the battle. It's a mistake. I forgot to do it. Oh, he come back. How could you? How could you? How could you, man? How could you? Scorpion. We will pierce their heart. Frenzy. Oh, we, this is it. They're all starting out now. We have lost this battle, guys. We have lost Tolosa. It is not good. But I'm hoping that they're going to be weak enough now for me to attack them with my secondary army and actually win. That is going to be the aim. Blingers. Rally. Oh, he's a good general as well. I hate it when this happens. <coughs> Damn campaign map bullshit. Scotari Spearman. Let's pull the slingers up here, I think. Try and break away from the spear warriors. Maybe get a few more shots on them. That might be a good idea. This unit's routing, mercenary Gallic Light Horse. Got quite a few mercenary units I noticed. It's nice to see the AI utilize the the mercenary system like that. Warriors eager for blood. Inspiration. I'm gonna fast forward this guys because it's gonna be boring to watch otherwise. I don't like to bore you guys too much. War cry on the spear warriors. The good thing is they're in the but my general's in a defensive position. They are outflanking me though, which is a bit of a problem. Get the second wind going on him as well. Ah, there they go. They're all starting to go now. They're all wavering. Don't waver. No. No, don't do it. Don't do it, child. Don't do it. Ah, I hate it when this happens. They're gone. General's still alive. Just about. He's routed in now though. Casabellanos. He is gone. Nope, he's still alive. Rally! <laughs> it would be quite funny if I won this battle now, but it's not going to happen, of course. We are outnumbered. We did take out some of the slingers, though, so I'm hoping they won't reform on the on the campaign map. We'll see now what they have. They lost a thousand men, so they're only at half strength. So that should be good for us. Ten minute battle, we killed... 969. We lost this town. Uh, see, I want this army to reinforce. It, uh, I hate when it happens. Noble death. We're going to skip that. Close defeat. Tried our best. Just hoping another ar army doesn't march down here, but it doesn't look like it has. Some knights, Libya. And now it's our turn. Oh, what the hell is this bullshit? Who at the. Ba -ba 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 what the hell is this? Okay, guys. I'm going to end the episode here. Hope you've all enjoyed. I've been Dragonheart. Until next time, goodbye.